Hello, everybody, and welcome back to AIML's channel. We're sitting here once again with Tim, and there's an exciting announcement on the horizon. But Tim, first off, how are you doing today? I'm doing fine, Michael. How are you? I'm doing pretty well myself. So tell me about this uh, this transaction you guys just completed. Tell me who you acquired and what's going on there. Yeah, I'd love to. Um, so we just completed the transaction in a French company called Tech to Heal, um, which is a, a mental wellness and health tech products and services company out of Paris. There's two main components to the transaction. One is we uh, acquire a 22.22% interest in the, uh, the, the global parent company called Tech to Heal. Um, we also have control, 70% interest in the uh, North American rights to all the products um, uh, of, of the company uh, for the US, Canada, and Mexico. Um, and, uh, 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 and, and under that, we will be you know, in control of the, uh, the operation of the company and um, the market penetration strategy going forward in the North American markets. Wonderful. Can you just give people a brief summary of what it is they do again for those not familiar yet? Sure. So Tech to Heal is the company name and their um, product line is actually called Tech to Health. And it's uh, a digital healthcare innovator. And they have a, a portfolio of mental wellness and health tech products and services that uh, are designed to improve individuals' mental well-being by utilizing a, a unique blend of uh, proprietary digital assets, remote live counseling and physical wellness center. What that all means is, is that they're able to provide um, counseling right from the most serious cases where, um, uh, where we're talking about you know, serious uh, uh, chronic anxiety and depression, um, even tendencies of suicide and so on, where people need psychotherapy and, and therapeutics down through to um, mental wellness where, you know, individuals need um, certain, you know, pick-me-ups and, and can benefit from, you know, body and mind healing techniques um, del delivered through a digital platform, uh, such as, you know, yoga and Tai Chi and, uh, um, and other uh, art therapies and other classes uh, such as that. Um, their business model is, uh, is B2B, so they're offering their services um, also to the general public, but, but their primary focus is uh, dealing with uh, insurance companies and, uh, and large corporations uh, providing you know, this mental health support to these uh, 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 um, large organizations. Several studies have come out recently showing that the new pandemic is the, you know, the mental health, health uh, pandemic, um, in part because of, you know, the, the global uh, coronavirus pandemic and the, uh, the stresses and strains that that has put on, you know, society globally. Um, and nearly half of employees globally uh, who have been recently surveyed have indicated a, a, a lower state of mental wellness than what they were, you know, over the last year or 18 months. So it seems to be affecting more people than, than not. Um, and other studies have shown that on the corporate level, for every $1 that companies are investing in, um, uh, in, in mental health wellness, it's returning about $4 to the corporation in, uh, in better productivity for the corporation. So um, companies are finding that it's, it's money well spent for them. Uh, in other words, you know, healthy employees equals a healthy company. Um, and Tech to Health has been able to um, uh, uh, achieve some really good traction very early in their existence. Um, in the first month of going live with their new platform, um, they were able to secure three significant contracts. When I say significant, I'm talking um, two with major uh, European-based insurance companies, one with uh, a France-based um, uh, industrial corporation that has a global presence um, and has about 180,000 employees uh, stationed all over the world. And these are all um, multi-year uh, contracts. And um, uh, uh, Tech to Health uh, um, uh, estimates that these contracts 
collectively will produce over the, the life of them about $5 million worth of revenue. So to sign you know, three contracts collectively worth about $5 million in your first month of operation is, uh, is a good starting point. And so, uh, so we're really uh, uh, excited and pleased to be partnering with uh, Tech to Health going forward. Wonderful. Yeah. I mean, it's definitely interesting that now we're starting to see this shift on the business level where they understand that abstract concept of, okay, it's worth investing in our people ab- abstractly. Like a lot of people didn't grasp the mental health side of things for a very long time. But now the studies are coming out. They're showing people are worth helping. They're worth investing in. And you're 100% right. There's a definitely a COVID burnout happening with people psychologically. It's, it's rough. Everyone's sick of dealing with this stuff and everybody needs a little bit of help right now. So I think tech health is in, in completely in the right sector. They're doing exactly what the world needs right now. And what would you say is next now that you guys have taken this position? Well, we um, are uh, going through a, a, a deployment plan right now for the North American markets. And to that end, we have some um, significant dialogue underway already with some uh, major players within the, the U- US healthcare environment. Um, for us, working smart rather than hard is, is partnering with, with people who already have uh, the infrastructure in place to, um, to help make us a success. And so that's the, the tack that we're taking. Um, as well with Tech to Health itself on a global basis, they are um, in the midst of multiple discussions both throughout uh, Europe and South America, which are their two uh, strong suits. And, and so we're, uh, we're anticipating some significant um, uh, announcements to the marketplace over the upcoming weeks and months in both the, uh, the North American marketplace as well as uh, globally. Wonderful. Well, Tim, thank you so much for coming on. Thanks for walking us through this news announcement. And thank you, everyone, for watching. If you have any questions about any of it, let us know. and We'll happily dive into it. But for now, stay tuned. We'll get you some more news over the wire as soon as it comes in. Tim, thank you for your time today. Thanks for having me, Michael.